it's good to watch other channels like it's good to like watch other people learn a few things you know one or two things and learn how to like make your channel better but at the same time it affects one's mental health because if you are if you're a new youtuber or you're trying to start your own channel this is a mistake that we've made in the past that is best for you to avoid hey guys welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here my name is gusty chipike i'm a youtuber based in lagos nigeria and if this is not your first time yeah i know long time no video and longest time no sit down video because i've been doing um vlogs for the longest time and um i stopped like over a month and i haven't done i don't think i've done a sit down video this year i don't think so <laughs> so yes i am here with another sit down video um kind of talking about my absence and all um you guys there is this i've been feeling like i'm not enough i'm not doing enough just that feeling of not being enough as a content creator the moment you it's good to watch other channels like it's good to like watch other people learn a few things you know one or two things and learn how to like make your channel better but at the same time it affects one's mental health because then you watch and you're like ah this can make this this you start to compare and really when you cannot afford to do that particular to have that kind of content you wish to have like oh i wish i had a camera i wish i had a better um place i wish i had this i wish i had that and then you begin to compare a lot that you stop filming totally because you feel what you have is not up to and then i've always been the type that would say start with what you have do with what you have make do with what you have but yeah i don't know what happened and i began to like and i began to like feel like i'm not enough what i have is not enough i think this is too much of watching all of those content and instead of just learning i'm busy comparing and secondly i was talking to a youtuber kate she's my friend and then i asked her like how that baby is youtube she's like how that i think she told me something that i realized was the problem <clears throat> so if you are if you're a new youtuber or you're trying to start your own channel this is a mistake that we've made in the past that is best for you to avoid changing niche when i started my youtube i started with um giving my ideas my opinions on trending topics and then i got subscribers and not the funny thing when you change your niche maybe you've not even built a fan base a community there's no between having subscribers and building a fan base maybe we just come to your channel because we are giving gossip trending gist oh i want to know what is trending and they've not come for you they're just coming for the content you do sometimes it gets to a stage some people come for you no matter what you do they are going to watch because they now love you they're coming to your channel for you but the moment you're not coming for you yet you're just coming for your content and then you switch on that content those ones you made those people that have subscribed they're not like your new content so they will not watch and then you have subscribers you don't have people that are viewing your videos or people that even like it people that even comment it because you've not built a community and then you're trying to like okay this new one that you've changed to i'm trying to like, okay let me i'm using myself for example i moved from trending topic i moved to another I moved, but I can't remember what I moved to because I realized that I was an actor doing trending topics. I will not talk about my co-actor, a producer, a director or something. I don't want to be hypocritical. I don't want to come and say what would ruin my career in the long run, you know, just trying to play safe. So I'm like, I'm stopping this. Then I changed to something else. I think it was lifestyle, but I wasn't really, I was doing restaurant reviews. I was, and then I changed. Just imagine you, I made subscribers that, oh, when you want to go to come to Lagos, Go to this person's page you might see one or two ideas on restaurant reviews and all that and then they're not yet yeah, they're not my fans it's just people that want to watch and i moved to lifestyle fully relationship um self-improvement that is what i'm doing now and but lately last year i was basing my struggles as a as a single girl in her 30s in nigeria all that concerning single girl in her 30s video yeah, that i was doing that and then i just stopped and moved to my um living in lagos um my 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 life of a single girl in her 30s in lagos so you see a lot of change 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 changing when i've not built a community changing when i've not built a family when i've not built a fan base 
so because i was feeling i was feeling like i'm not growing like what am i not growing and then kate made me realize that catherine made me realize that my, this might be why you are not we think we're not growing because we keep changing like this is not what we said this is not for example me this is not i think i've changed like three times and you keep changing you keep changing and now okay this is what i want to do now relationship talk um vlogs like that's my lifestyle as a single girl in her 30s living in lagos and then self-improvement so yes so i have to like build a fan base or build subscribers that would now know this is what this person does on her channel so people come for that and then maybe subscribe and then like me for me and keep watching or keep coming back but the most important thing is don't be changing your niche back and forth if you've not built a family if you've not built a community that was what happened to me and i felt like i wasn't growing i felt stuck coupled with the fact that i felt i wasn't good enough i wasn't giving enough content my place is not that fine my this is that my that 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 that, that. oh i'm not going out what will i vlog for this week like too much pressure and youtube is a lot of mental work it's good to love what you're doing on youtube but love the fact that you youtube i love it but at the same time we are humans we want to see growth like i wake up in the morning and post a new video next thing i'm going to do is check how many views what has happened this has happened that has happened and then you put yourself in that box of trying so hard to check to know what's up to know no 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 and at the end of the day you're sad because the thing is not aligned the way you want it to do to align like this year i woke up with the whole i want to get monetized this year i want to push and i started telling people please don't just watch my video like drop a comment no matter how little you know just do something to help their algorithm the engagement is very important and all that and it's been tough so i'm like okay i'm not in this shit anymore i want to just quit i'm not in again but then i watch youtube a lot i'm always on youtube or like every day i open youtube i watch one or two videos i have people i love to watch on youtube and i'm like god i really love to do this thing you know? let me just start this thing again and let me just just like it's a love and hate relationship it's a toxic relationship i have right now with youtube but yeah this is me just saying that if you're somewhere you want to start your channel and i i wouldn't advise people want to start just start just start just start because YouTube is funny. This YouTube overtaking is allowed. This thing I say about my acting career. My mother and actor they are telling, please, how do I how do I get how do I get in? And the next thing you are bigger than that actor. Overtaking is allowed in life. I think in general in life, overtaking is allowed. So my come and be, be watching your channel and be like, ah, I love this person. It doesn't even happen to me. Oh, because I love your channel, blah 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 blah. And the next thing I'm seeing that they are monetized and I'm like, and I'm still here. <laughs> So yeah, I always tell people want to start, start. So I think it's not for me to take my own advice. Don't just let oh this is what I have. Work with what you have. Start with whatever you have and just start building. Who knows? People might love you. You might build your own fan base. You might have your own subscribers. I'm like I've been doing YouTube for three years. What if I just quit when I'm about to like start making it? Then all my efforts would have gone down the drain. So yes, right now I'm trying to just stay consistent to my the niche i have chosen lifestyle um relationship and talking about um life um, improvement how to self-improvement so yeah on sundays generally i have to drop my vlog but this video this time video is going, going up on sunday so we'll just continue from next sunday or from next week so i'll drop my vlog then during the week whether i'll choose the wednesday i will drop either a relationship video or a self-improvement video like i'll just be shuffling those ones but compulsorily on sunday we have um life of a single in that is vlog coming up every sunday i want to really try and be consistent and you know not get overwhelmed i mean i'm human some days i just wake up and i'll be like this thing is not paying and i try to take my money on my time on my everything but yeah we are here again you guys i don't know what this video is about what this video is heading to but this is me just coming to rant and say i didn't just disappear you guys i've just been going through it and i hope you understand and still like the videos subscribe and comment if you've ever been i don't know in a tight space in life you don't have to be a youtuber if you're just like struggling with something or you know having that feeling of i'm not enough i'm not enough you are enough you're doing enough you're doing the best you can do in your situation so just keep at it and let the noise get in all right guys thank you very much for watching i'll be seeing you in my next video
बाय